let's get um, just started on chapter six. And I'm going to give you a quick overview before you read it even. And the whole thing is just a switch from working on service companies where we have um, where we don't really sell goods to others, but what we do is we sell services, you know, like like being an interior decorator or a real estate agent or an accountant or an attorney to selling merchandise. Okay, so the first thing that changes is that the balance sheet goes from um, not having inventory to having inventory on it. Okay, merchandise inventory. So think even Walmart, okay, big stores. So it's an asset until it's sold, and then once it's sold, it moves down here into cost of goods sold. So in a merchandising company, we've got sales revenue plus cost of goods sold is gross profit. Just like in that makeup quiz, okay, all those companies had cost of goods sold. Service, whoops, service companies just have service revenue and wage expense. Okay? Oh, no, 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 I'm sorry, but service revenue and then a couple of expenses, but there is no cost of service revenue. All right, so what we've done is we've added um, an inventory account, we added cost of goods sold, and then a new subtotal here called gross profit. And that's an important number because you can take that gross profit percentage, like take gross profit and divide it by sales, and then you can compare it to prior, um, say, prior years in the same company, or you can compare it to other companies. All right, so that's what the whole thing is about. Okay.